Hey, I really like the amount of feedback and conversation about having meaningful conversations. And this one I, I just want to touch base on. Can you disagree with someone and still be friends with them? In this day and age, we got a lot of opinions. There's a lot of, I really, for lack of a better term right now, chaff and flair on all networks about different things. The media really knows how to manipulate and set people on an emotional spiral. And it's very easy to get caught up in your feelings when you're talking about something you feel passionate about. And you get into an argument with someone. And they disagree with you. And it becomes heated. Maybe some words are said. Maybe no one's listening. No one's actively listening. Maybe no one is maybe paraphrasing or reading back what someone else says and try to validate feelings and try to understand the other perspective. But at the end of the day, if you disagree with this person, can you still be friends with them? And I hope the answer for you is yes. And if the answer is no, like I'm not talking to them because they're totally off the rails, then my question to you is why? Is it because they drum up too much emotion in you? Then my question would be, why is this making you so emotional? Why can't you accept the fact that someone will have a different opinion than you as long as it's not harming you in any way or your children or, or anything and that the best you could do is have them try to see your point or your side of the story and then you keep being cordial and then understand that they bring a different perspective and that you can appreciate them for doing that. If you are unable to do that, you have to ask yourself why and try to figure out how you can get into that space. Look, I'm not perfect either. There are times that some people will say some wild stuff to me and I may have to take a break from them for a little bit, but I will, I will try and come back to them and, and have a conversation. There are some things for me that are deal breakers. If you're gonna say something racial, then we, you know, and you're gonna continue that ignorant train of thought. Maybe we need to part ways. So there's some things that are deal breakers. But other than that, if I really disagree with you and it's gotten very heated, I wanna come back and have, still have a conversation and follow up. I say in my book, Shatter the Sky, we're going to the stratosphere, taught me about self-worth, sacrifice, and discipline. Is if I disagree with you, but at the end of the day, I can't have a beer with you, then someone took it personal. And I really try to stay to that. I'm not always perfect, as I said before. There's certain things that you cross the line with me, you're, you're not gonna get a pass on. And so, try to do that. Try to agree to disagree and remain friends and remember that they bring a different perspective and there are people who think that way as well. And try to understand that. Doesn't mean you have to compromise, just means you understand.